Chef's Mark Hall visited this afternoon with the chefs of the fairgrounds and tells us all about their favorite dishes. Think of the first thing you see as you enter the fairgrounds. No, not that. These. A huge line of folks ready to tickle your tummy with a variety of yummies. You can pick the Dothan High School Tiger Tail. We start out with a holy sausage, we put a little chili on it, and we put a little cheese on it, and then we put a whole lot of jalapeno peppers on it. Or the Northview High School chicken sandwich. We created this chicken sandwich. This is an actual Northview Bambooster original. And we just all stood around one day and said, what do you think it tastes best, and what do you think it tastes best, and this is what we came up with. There's a variety of Polish sausages to choose from, from the disabled veterans, the First Assembly of God Church, and Lafayette Street United Methodist Church. There's even a Shrine Burger. We use two patties of Shrine of hamburger meat, two slices of cheese and pickles, and one wiener. Makes it a big, big Shrine Burger, and and some chili on it. There's a few items you might not expect. The red beans and rice we've had for three years. Uh, this is going on our third year having them. It's based on a New Orleans recipe. We can't give any specifics out. Uh, anybody that wants to know the recipe will need to buy some. If you look right here, we've got uh, sweet roasted corn in the shuck. Illinois Super Sweet. If you eat one of those, you'll never eat another boiled corn. We also got the old-fashioned pork skins right here, hickory smoke. There's tasty elephant ears and funnel cakes, but how can you talk about food at the Peanut Festival without mentioning those corn dogs? These are not frozen dogs. These are freshly made. Just dip this dog in this batter, put it in the French fryer, just like that, and there you have it. How about that? After visiting all the booths here at the fair, I had a tough time deciding exactly what I wanted to take home with me, so I just got one of everything. From the National Peanut Festival, Mark Hall, WTVY News.